I wonder why was this team able to overcome everything y'all overcame tonight and win in that fashion? Just the ability for everyone to, you know, have the confidence in themselves throughout the whole game. I mean, we preach nine innings uh, no matter what. You know, you can get us in the first eight, but this, you know, offensively, you, you got to get us for nine, and it's not an easy three outs throughout the whole game. Uh, I thought consistently through all nine innings, we gave tough at-bats besides maybe my, uh, my ground out to the pitcher in the seventh, but... I mean, it just shows the willingness for guys, you know, to pick their teammates up, and I couldn't be any more proud of those guys in there waiting for media. When when y'all are trailing and trying to fight back and come back, are, are, are y'all talking to each other? Is it kind of a, a silent confidence that, that you just kind of know what you need to do and, and you don't really need to talk about it? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. I think, I mean, situations like that, you know, you got to ratchet up the communication to uh, you, you just got to let your teammates know what you see and, and what, you know, if I strike out in three pitches, I, I got to give a little – something for the next guy behind me to where he might can get it done. I, I just think, you know, the nine guys that were in there and even the guys over on the bench watching and, and the coaches as well, you know, we do a great job communicating and, and letting everybody know what you see to get the job done. And I, I think that's what helped us a lot tonight. What did you see from Kavaris leading off the, the ninth there? Just an unbelievable at bat. I mean, I'm not sure what he hit. I think it might have been a change up, but man, that, that guy's worked so hard to keep his direction that way. Um, you know, last year he was the last out, and we were joking about it coming up here, but being serious at the same time. Um, you know, that, that guy deserves every awards and achievements he gets, and, and it's just awesome to see that payoff out there tonight. And then, of course, what did you see from Burke there with the, the tying hit? Just the ability to, you know, compete his butt off the whole at bat. I mean, that's not an easy situation. I've felt in those situations many and many a times. But, you know, that guy is a hard worker. He's the most confident guy in the building, one of the most confident hitters I've ever been around. Talented and, and, and just, you know, he was just willing to get it done no matter what. You know, he grinded out a long at bat against the lefty on lefty. And he just stayed up the middle and put a good swing on that breaking ball right there. It was awesome. Actually, it might have been a high heater, but I mean, it was just an incredible at bat. And then walk me through what you saw with dry lanes at bat and, and just the emotions of knowing that you all were going to win and, and the celebration on the field. Yeah, I mean, I, when, he, when Dylan came up right there, you know, they just brought that guy in. He was a lot of sliders. And uh, funny story, he, he comes up to me, he said, You want to hit or not? And I told him no. And he said, All right, I'll walk it off. And. <laughs> You know, they went 0-0 slider. He, he spit on it, you know, very under control. And he was hunting at 1-0 as well. You know, I think that guy threw like nine sliders in a row to lefties last weekend, no heater. So, I mean, he was just hunting with conviction. He got a pitch to do it on, man. And he he kept his direction, not trying to do too much and, and put a beautiful swing on that ball. Last one for you. I know Simo has had just a spectacular season and it doesn't really feel like anything can surprise anybody at this point with what he does, but second player to ever hit for the cycle in the College World Series. What you see from him tonight? I mean, he's the best player I've ever been around. You know, I've been around big leaguers left and right, but I mean, that guy, he, he does special stuff on the field and um, just the ability to spark this team, you know, even in the first inning, that triple, yeah, crazy, it was his first one all year. But uh, yeah, I mean, that guy, he was just seeing beach balls and he's a competitor. And you know, when your game's on the line, you want that guy up. Um, I think that one against Evansville hurt him pretty good. So he, he's really been hunting since then. And man, just a great, Great approach tonight from him, and I'm very happy for that guy.